I'm as frustrated right now as I've ever been. I just can't believe this. Don't have the key. What's going on? Dr. Higgs and Dr. Loken have decided to protest your appointment as father's successor. They've taken control of the bioscience security systems and cut off our food supply. Oh, great. Like I don't have enough problems. Well, I'm sorry you've been inconvenienced. But solving personnel issues is part of an administrator's job. Is there a way I can communicate with them? As a matter of fact, there is. I can unlock the maintenance tunnel that leads to the bioscience observation room. From there, you should be able to communicate with Higgs and Logan. If you can't reason with them, you can use this holotape to access the command functions on the observation room terminal. That should give you some options. Just please, try to talk to them first. Use violence only as a last resort. Newton. It's damn selfish. That's what it is. In all my years, I've never seen anything like this. The sheer impertinence of it. For what it's worth, I think you're a fine choice to take Father's place. I'm as frustrated right now as I've ever been. I just can't believe this. Here we are. Just give me a moment. There, it's unlocked. Dr. Oberlin. I'm sure some of the others will question your appointment as our next director. Don't let it bother you. Remember, they control the defense systems. Be careful. There's an opportunity here to demonstrate your ability to lead. I hope you'll make the most of it. Newton. Good to see you. Feeling well today? People on the surface have got it pretty bad. Makes me thankful for being down here. I hope all your needs are being seen too. You just let me know if they're not. For what it's worth, I have every confidence in you. Higgs and Loken don't speak for all of us. Attacking enemy. the guards. Hmm? Impressive. Dr. Higgs. If you've come to change our minds, then you're wasting your time. 
Can we talk about this? Father chose not to talk to the Directorate before anointing you his successor. So how about I follow his fine example? Father believes in me. The least you can do is give me a chance. How could you hope to lead us when you hardly know anything about what we do? I'm sure you mean well, but you must see that it's an impossible task. Maybe, maybe not. All I'm asking is that you keep an open mind. I'm sorry, but our minds are made up. Both Dr. Loken and I have resolved to stand our ground. Can't you at least give me a chance? A chance? Hmm. What do you think, Max? Even the most fastidious researcher must sometimes take a leap of faith. I say let's give it a try. Very well, then. Open the door. And let's return to the fold. Since abort command override and resume normal function. Can't pick this. Dr. Higgs. What others call complaining. Max, I call critical you have a lot to learn. Challenging assumptions. Really Excuse me. Nothing to report, sir. The Institute. Bravo. I admit I was fearing for the worst, but I can see that I underestimated you. What do you mean you feared the worst? I just didn't want to see anyone get hurt. There is one further matter to discuss. Obviously, some kind of disciplinary action must be taken here. The question of what form it takes is up to you. They were prepared to let everyone starve to death. They have to die. I... I understand. I'll make the necessary arrangements, though it saddens me to do so. I'll see that the mess in hydroponics is cleaned up. I suppose I should also make the funeral arrangements. Well, there's much to do, so I'll get about it. In the meantime, I'm sure everyone will be relieved that this is over. Newton. When the lights go down and the stars come out, man just forgets about all his troubles. Dr. Higgs and Dr. Loken will never threaten the Institute again. Good work, sir. Hey there.